Hello guys, today we do have the second leg of the Coppa Italia against Juventus and I think the aggregate score is 1-1 so we've got that game and a couple more games in the league so let's get into it, let's cue the intro. <laughs> Oh no, and welcome back to the AC Milan career mode and it's me Dan back again and today, like I said, we do have the Juventus um, second leg in the Coppa Italia. We will be playing that today and I think we've got a couple more games in the league. Um, we've got Fiorentina, in which I might visual see him and then we've got a game against Cagliari um, which we'll probably probably finish up on. So just before we start I just want to say thank you guys for all the recent likes and comments recently and I just want to say thank you to all new subscribers for subscribing so thank you guys for that as well and if you're not subscribed please hit that subscribe button and uh, if you haven't liked the video yet please hit that like button and don't forget to hit that notification bell uh, just to notify you guys when I upload. So uh, we do have a press conference up first. Let's do that. Let's get into the press conference and then we shall get into the game. <coughs> oh, it always lags when I first start recording. Oh, dear. Um, I think that's just with every game. I uh, Not every game. I think that's every press, press conference we always do. Anyway, right. Let's get into the game. Um, I think we was going to play the second team, I think. Uh, who we got after this? We've got Florentina. Do you know what? Yeah, we will go in with the second team. So let's get into it. Let's play match in, shall we? Good ball. Oh, it's gone in. It's a good cross. Um, it's Diaz with the cross. It's a low ball in um, to Isaac. And he's... I'm, so, I'm surprised he actually got it. I thought he missed it completely. Um, just good through ball to Diaz. And then down that right hand side. Great cross in. And yeah, just a good finish from Isaac. Um, the goalkeeper does save it, but I think the power does it. Um, gets it past Wojciech Szczesny. And uh, yeah, there we go. We'll take that. So that is 1-0. 2-1 on aggregate. That's a good ball. Taran, surely this time. And he does. It's 2-0. Finally got that second goal. Um, for the last couple of minutes in this second half, we've, you know, hunted for that second goal and we finally got it with a Taron. Uh, it's a great header from the, is he Dutch? I think he is Dutch, isn't he? I'm pretty sure. Um, but he's a great uh, cross in from Calabria. And yeah, this time, I think he did have a shot just a minute ago that was just saved. But this time his shot, well, his header goes in. And Chesney, yeah, no chance as it's right in front of him. Um, but yeah, 2 0. We'll definitely take that, Mohamed Taran. So yeah, 2 0. And there we go. There's full time. And we have beaten uh, Juventus 2 0. Uh, 3 1 on the night. That was 2 0 on the night, but 3 1 on aggregate. Um, yeah, great game for us. So it weren't, there wasn't too many. Uh, chances for Juventus. Juventus did have a really good chance right at the end there. Um, Murray made a really good save. Um, and I, he's actually proving quite to be a really good goalkeeper for this second team, uh, I have to say. Uh, so let's look at the highlights. Um, so Wojciech Chesney makes a save here. Um, it's good, almost a good team goal. <clears throat> the ball goes through to Diaz, and then Diaz's shot is just uh, past the, goal the goalkeeper. I actually thought this went might have just went way too wide, but it's actually... Almost curling in. Well, yeah, would have curled into the uh, net. So that was unlucky there. Uh, Alexander Isaac does have a chance here. Um, good cross in. It's diving header. Just right. It just goes right in front of him. Um, I was surprised he actually got it, actually. It looked like PK was going to get there. But, yeah, good header. Um, just unfortunate. And, obviously, he did score from uh, a couple minutes later. Uh, Chesney also makes another save here. I don't know what that was <laughs> um, from the computer. But it's a really good... Uh, tackle and then good ball in from Isaac into Rashika and Rashika um, tries to finesse shot just underneath the PK's leg as you can see there and it's a good save from Wojciech Szczesny and then obviously Hataran makes a goal later on um, so yeah they had three shots three on target we had nine shots eight on target I thought we had less shots than that to be honest um, it looks like Alexander Isaac got man of the match with an 8.5 although Hataran got 8.5 as well so they both shared it and uh, yeah 
I think we just played better in the end. So let's go into the post-match interview and then see what's what. And then we'll get into the uh, next couple of games. Um, right, okay. Uh, yeah, it's all about the final now. Um, I'm, I'm trying to think if we won the cup last year. Didn't we? Did Yeah, we did win the cup last year, didn't we? I'm pretty sure. Um, or well, last season, I should say, not last year. Um, right, so we're on a 97 now. Great. Uh, so let's keep going then. Yeah, so we got um, Florentino. I've almost forgot what they're called. They're 16th. I used to remember that Florentino used to be a really good team, but now, it, I don't know, maybe they just don't sim well. Anyway, uh, we do have a press conference, so let's do that, and then we shall get into the Florentino game. I think I might just quick sim it, um, just be quicker for you guys. Um, and then we've got Cagliari. And do you know what? I might just sim up towards our next game, to be honest. Um, so, yeah, Florentina, right, uh, first team it is, quick sim, can we get a result, and we do, only just, Rashford with the only goal of the game, uh, although I think we deserve more, six shots, five on target, 59% possession to their zero shots, and uh, 41% possession, uh, Rashford got an 8.4, uh, Donnarumma had an 8.2, um, no substitutions either, um, but yeah, a 1-0 victory. We will definitely take that. Um, on to the next game, which is against Cagliari, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, so we now we now are nine points ahead of uh, Napoli now. So we are doing pretty good. Um, so we will definitely um, get on to that in a second. Anyway, so let's keep going. Uh, we've got a couple of training. I think that there is a international break coming up as well. If I'm not too mistaken. So there might be an international break next next episode. Um, which we can skip past that. Um, we have another press conference to deal with. So let's do that. Um, let's try and win again. Yeah, it was a great result. Yeah, let's go. Yeah, so we, obviously we got the Man City game. But we won that game 4-0, was it, in the first half? Uh, no, was it 4-1, actually? I think it might have been 4-1. Uh, talking of which, is Rashford now the lead goal scorer? He is. 19 goals. Thank God for that. Right. Cagliari now. Um, I think I might go with the second team. Yeah, let's go with, with the second team because then we can have the first team for that. Wow. Uh, we'll go with that <laughs> first team for that Man City game. And I wish I went with the first team now because uh, we lost. <laughs> apparently we lost. Uh, <laughs> well, apparently we won 6-4 in aggregate. Um, but we didn't. Uh, we lost 3-2 to Cagliari at home. Uh, Isaac got our first goal. I uh, got our last goal. Um, Simeone got their um, winning goal. And Pereiro got their goals. But Isaac and Nandez got the first goals. And then Pereiro, like I said, and Isaac and Simeone. Uh, they had three, four shots, three on target. We had seven shots, six on target. So it was just unlucky there. Um, who had it? Oh, Calabria. Oh, dear. And uh, Tonali, 4.7. Ouch. Um, it looks like Pereiro got man a match with an 8.5 rating. Wow, we have just lost to Cagliari. And I think that must have been our second loss in the league, which is really bad for us. I'm not too... Ooh, that's a bit of a worry. Um, I'm pretty sure. Well, actually, let's... Uh, yeah, actually, we'll look on this. It'll be easier just to look on this. Uh, pick competition... It's Syria. Uh, was it our, oh no, it was our first loss, actually. Uh, first loss this season. I thought we uh, already lost the game. Wow, so we lost to Cagliari. I can't believe that. <laughs> Where are Cagliari in the, in the table at the moment? Where are they? Um, they are 10th. So they was probably down like 12th or 13th then before that. So that is a massive three points for them. A really... Big, massive. Yeah, so, um, do you know what? I think I will. Um, uh, have we got time? Do you know what? Actually, I'll save it. I'll save it for next episode, I think. Um, the Mad City game. We'll do that. We've got Torino as well. And then we do have that international break, uh, which we'll skip. And then, yeah, look at this month. We've got uh, Juventus. We've got Atalanta. We've got Inter Milan in the same... Um, in the same month, and I expect we'll have the next round of the uh, Champions League to do as well here, I expect. So, 
Yeah, we've got quite a few games in April uh, to look forward to. Um, you know what? Let's just do the press conference to get it passed. Um, we've got time to do that. Why not? Um, and then we can don't have to do that next episode. Thank God for that. Um, right, guys. Yeah, so I think I will uh, end it here for today. Um, so, yeah, next episode we shall be doing the Man City game, even though we won... Uh, Oh, did we sell to Coutinho to Man City? Wow. Um, even though we won the game 4-1, um, you know, we might just have to visual sim it just in case. Um, so anyway, guys, I'm actually going to end it here for today. So please like, comment and subscribe. And I will see you guys next time. So right, I'm going. Bye.